Hi everyone, welcome to iOS and Android 411. Today I have the uh, Galaxy Note 3. Uh, this is a Verizon model and it's on 4.4.2. Um, I'm going to be showing you how to root it. Okay, uh, this will work for 4.3 as well. So here we go, and this method is pretty simple. We're going to be using a tower root. Okay, so on your computer, on your PC, go to uh, www.towerroot.com and you will see the uh, screen just like this on my computer and go ahead and click on this uh, lambda sign this Greek sign right here and it will download the, uh, the program onto your uh, computer and this is actually a uh, app that uh, you will be installing on your phone so once you have it uh, you want to drag and drop it onto your phone so as you can see here go ahead and copy this copy and I'm gonna go ahead and plug in my phone and uh, just make sure that your computer reads your phone uh, you can open up the USB computer connection and make sure uh, uh, media device is tapped then you go to my computer and then your phone should pop up here as you can see right there Okay, click on your phone, and here is your the basically the root of your phone where all your files are. Go ahead and just uh, right click and then paste that file. It it will say uh, tr. So we're gonna go to my files. Uh, my files in Samsung Note three will be in Tools, and it's right there. My files, and then go to all files. And then you will be able to see it right there. Just go ahead and click on it. And it says install block. So go ahead and press settings. And just make sure that the uh, unknown sources are checked. And then it will take you back to this screen here. Press install. And accept. Agree to uh, terms and condition. Install. Then you can open it up. The... So here is the actual app that is basically a one-click root. So I don't know if you guys could see it on my phone here. But this button here, it says make it rain. So just click that. So now you want to go into your Play Store and download Super User. Play Store. And just type in uh, Super SU. Super SU right there, and under Chain Fire for free, click that and install. Once Super User is uh, done installing, and open it up, and uh, here the screen here it says uh, the SU binary needs to be updated, so you can go ahead and press Continue. And this next screen says custom recovery, normal, or basically custom uh, recovery. I'll usually put normal. And then you wait uh, for it to um, update its binary. Now, if it does hang up here for a minute, uh, you go ahead and reboot and then um, basically uh, go back into the super user app and it should be uh, completed. So the next screen here, it's saying that uh, it wants to try to disable uh, Samsung Knox. And you can press OK. And there you guys have it. Your Samsung Galaxy Note 3 Verizon is now rooted. Do you guys find this uh, video helpful? If so, share it. Uh, give me a like, thumbs up, uh, subscribe to iOS and Android 411. And uh, stay tuned for more videos. All right. Talk to you guys later. Bye.